Hello and welcome back to Three Pints and the Clean Sheet Showdown. As a thank you for all your support throughout the season, we're releasing this bonus series where three of our fans will take on Robert and Kyle at the character game and the transfer game. We're playing a round-robin format where each player plays four fixtures, one against each opponent, and plays each game twice. Best performers will then qualify for the grand final. Today it sees two guests face off against each other. We've got Ash, who you've already seen play, and we've got other Kyle, who you have already seen play. We are playing the transfer game. Let's get started. In the transfer game, contestants are given a series of clues to guess the player from a specific transfer. They get fewer points the more clues they receive, and each player can guess once after each clue. Five points are awarded for a correct guess after clue one, the year and the fee. Four points after clue two, the player's position. Three points after clue three, their nationality. Two points after clue four, the club they left and one point after clue five, the club they joined. Whoever has the most points after five questions wins. So, player number one, 2022, 33 million pounds. So that's... Not last season, uh, not summer. I was going to say, that, that was, the start, was it, that's not the start of season, just going to the start of one, or January yeah, yeah. before. Free the Man City treble. Um, I've got man here. Uh, Sterling? No, not Raheem Sterling. Ash? I'm trying to think. My dates are so bad, man. Two seasons um, ago. And that doesn't help. There's been a lot that's happened. I think the timer's got to come out here. It might do. And then Ash? Nah. Nope. I was going to say Marata, but he was a lone loan. 2022, £33 million pounds for a defender. Uh, nah. Nah. I had one in mind, but it's... Sorry, go. For Denzel Dumfries again. It's not Denzel Dumfries. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm going to say... Who's he got it right back? No, I've got none. A, a, a kanji. No. 2022, £33 million for a defender from Senegal. Cool Valley. Cool Valley, three points. Nice. Left <laughs> Napoli to join Chelsea. God, he was rotten. Is he, not in, is he in Saudi now? Yeah, he's in Saudi. Was well, he not supposed to be like the next big thing as well? Oh, he, he was, was really good at Napoli. Probably. He was just and then left them like right as they won the league and absolutely stank the joint out at Chelsea. No, he left. What did he? No, they they won the league in twenty two twenty three. Yeah, so they he left before they and won that... the league. Yeah, that's what I said. Oh, I thought you said they left after they won the league. Yeah, yeah, no, he left before they won the league. He's had a rotten piece of luck. Uh, twenty eleven, thirty five million pounds. Twenty eleven, man. Andy Carroll. No. Oh, I'm so sure of it, man. Robin Van Persie? No. 2011, £35 million pounds for a striker. Suarez? No. How much million? £35. Wasn't it Aguero, was it? It was not. 2011, £35 million for a striker from Colombia. Fuck out. Falco, three points. Ash a girl was a good guess, to be fair, actually. I thought you got it with that. Yeah. Uh, Rado Falco left Porto with the giant Atletico Madrid. Player number three, 2012, 8 million. 2012, 8 million. No. To here. It's not having to hit. Oh, no, he, no, he was 18 million, not hit. Any guess? He's got Wikipedia up off screen. He's reading off transfers for that year. Oh, yeah. Well. Definitely. <laughs> uh, that, the idea. Nope. 2012, £8 million pounds for a striker. I think he left on. Um... No, he would have gone through my nose, went through my phone. 
Giroud. Jelovic. Not Olivier Giroud or Nikita Jelovic. 2012, £8 million pounds for a striker from Scotland. Ross McCormack. No. Bastard. Right, let me... None of these are guesses, but I'm just going to list off Scottish, Scottish strikers from about that time. I'm... I don't think it's Rhodes. I don't think it's Stephen... Oh, it could be, actually. He would have left... Aye, Stephen Fletcher. No. I think I know oh, that. He left, he left Wolves to go to Burnley about then. 2012, £8 million, pounds, striker from Scotland, left Huddersfield Town. Jordan Rhodes. It is Jordan Rhodes. Yeah. They go for £8 million. He, he went for £8 million pounds to Blackburn. He came in my head as soon as I said Ross McCormack. Eight I don't think he went for as much as that. Cost. Uh, next one is 2010, three and a half million. Peak Barclays. Uh, Franco De Santo. <laughs> it's not Franco De Santo. I love Franco De Santo. It's not Franco De Santo. Nico Crancia. It's also not Nico Crancia. No. 2010, three and a half million pounds for midfielder. Right, there's a lot of Peak Barclays. Kevin Nolan. No. Craig Bellamy. No. 2010, three and a half million pounds for a midfielder from the Ivory Coast. Chick Teoti. Chick Teoti, three points. I was never getting that. Left FC20 to join Newcastle. How many does Ash need? What, Ash needs five oh, wow. to draw. <laughs> Right, I'll, I'll actually I'll let him have first guess. And a draw will give you one point each in this format. There is no tie break. Oh, is there not? No, oh, no you're not you, first it guess. Will result any draw. Uh, 2010, eight million pounds. David De Gea. No. This is no it's at twelve. Uh, right, so I've won. Um, you have. Well done. What was it? 2010, eight million. 2010, eight million. Uh. Tevez. It's not Carlos Tevez. 2010, £8 million pounds for striker. Berbatov. No. Oh, I might have it. The walking man's footballer. I love Berbatov, eh? Like, that's the guy that just like, phoned it in right at the end. He just didn't care. <laughs> it's like videos of him at Fulham, like, literally just like... Full? It's not dreadful. Carry on with the videos from Fulham because I'm interested. Yeah, like there's, like, there's just videos of Fulham like, just like, lazing about the pitch. Like, I can't remember it as well, but there's that goal he scored where he like, volleys it for like, a really tight angle. And it's just like the most like lazy finish you've ever seen, but it's like, an unbelievable goal. He did need to run. His first touch is just... Yeah. Oh, I was insane. He was Casual. one of the best in the world for it. I do remember seeing him for Newcastle, like, like against Newcastle for Fulham. Um... It must. It can't have been. It must. Have, it mustn't have been any later than about twenty thirteen, and I swear he didn't get above what could be reasonably described as a trot the entire game. Yeah, he's, I love players like that. Like if you're good enough, like you'll get plenty of players that are just terrible at it. But see if you're good enough that you can just do do nothing and still be the best player on the pitch. Like similar car, similar uh, player to add into that bracket. Shola Um Moving on. Uh, twenty ten, eight million pounds, a striker. Now, Kyle, you said you think you had this. Would you like to guess before I give you the country, or would you like to wait till after the country to have a guess? You have one already. No, but no, I, I want the country, but I'll, I'll tell you. The, the, uh, the country might, you know, try that in Tobago. Oh, no, I'm not <laughs> I was going to say Robbie Keane. I thought I was only with Celtic. Adebayor? It's not Adebayor. He's Togo. Is he Togo, is he? He is. Oh, wow. Try that in Tobago. I remember a strike from. Is it Jason Scotland? It's not Jason Scotland. I think he was fit though. I think he was. 2010, eight million pounds. Striker from Trinidad and Tobago left Sunderland. Boo. Greg, you might as well pick someone at the Welsh Sunday League. Like, I've got no idea. You definitely know who this guy is. Trinidad and Tobago left Sunderland. Anybody? I did say Prime Barclays, and he is Prime Barclays. No. No, Ash? No, I've not got one. No. Nah. No. 2010, £8 million pounds striker from Trinidad and Tobago, left Sunderland and joined Stoke City. Prime Barclays. No, it's Straight not. Straight down the line. No messing. 
No, he he went from um, Cameron Jerome. It's not no. Oh, good shout. Ash, do you want a final guess? I want to say it starts with an A, but I could be wrong. But I'm I no think name. I know who you're thinking of, but no it's name, wrong. No names coming to me on that. Nope. Wait, land with final score. Kyle eight, Ash three. At least I got the scoreboard this time. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, would anyone like another guess as to who it is, or do you want me to read out some other clubs we need to be? Hi, that's a good idea, actually. Where else has he played? I'll see if I can. Right. Uh, Joe Public, W Connection, Southampton, Sheffield Wednesday on loan, Stoke City on loan, Sunderland, Stoke City, Cardiff City, Bournemouth on loan, Al Jazeera on loan, Atlanta United, and then Central. <laughs> that is, is pretty much who that is. He joined nice. Cardiff City in a player exchange for Peter Odom Wingy. Nice. So it's Sammy Ami will be or something. It's not, it's Kenwin Jones. Oh, Kenwin Jones. That's that's a sweet one for you. What what an absolute man Kenwin Jones was getting on the on the on the end of all those really good throw ins. <laughs> We've already announced the final score. Thank you very much for tuning in to another showdown. See you again soon. Looking at the table once again, Kyle Pagan jumps up to second on four points alongside Kyle and Robert. Ash, after three games, is still to score.